as it stands at the moment, hospitalizations are down, deaths are down. Uh, and so um, is this just a big old smoke screen to hide away what's going on in Westminster? Julian. Um, I'll, I'll start with that. Yes, 100% it is. I know for a fact that the Cabinet meeting that was held on Tuesday, Plan B coming in soon was not discussed. It wasn't even on the cards. And when the Cabinet were informed yesterday afternoon, it was only in a phone call uh, where some of them were even put on mute, uh, where they were not able to actually uh, discuss the issue properly. So, yeah, this was definitely brought in at the last minute. And I'm not aware of, and I don't know anyone else who is aware of, any new data suggesting there was any new sudden risk. Bearing in mind that in South Africa and in right around the world, there's not been a single death from uh, Omicron variant. And indeed, in South Africa, the cases have peaked and have started to go down in a country with very low vaccination rates compared to our stupendously high and very reassuring vaccination rates. So, yeah, this is a classic dead cat strategy, throwing a lot of people and their freedoms, a lot of businesses under the bus. And I've got to be honest with you, I think it's absolutely unforgivable.